recently done a video of me trying to speak Portuguese and I thought it would be interesting to get to know a bit more about Brazil because I don't really know that much about Brazil. Um, what I'd like to mention is that I'm going to make more of this type of videos and the language videos as well, but I also want to get back into making more personal attention videos as well, because I think they can be very helpful and I think they are important. Anyways, I hope you find this video interesting. Sit back and relax. Brazil is the fifth largest country in the world. I never realized Brazil was this big until I looked it up on the map. Brazil is named after a tree. Brazil wood. Brazil has 26 states and one federal district. The capital of Brazil is Brasilia, built in 1960. Brazil shares a border with nine countries. Every South American country except Chile and Ecuador. The highest point is Pico da Neblina at 2,994 meters, 9,820 feet. Brazil is ranked. Brazil has won the World Cup five times and perhaps its most famous player is Pelly. Sorry if I pronounce it wrong. Virtually every Brazilian city has a soccer stadium because they are crazy about soccer. Dutch people really like soccer as well. The Amazon River is the second long, longest river in the world and the world's largest river by volume. Interesting. The Amazon jungle is the greatest biodiversity on the planet. Brazil has 64 national parks and more than 200 conservation units. One of the interesting parks, Lengoi, Maranhenses National Park, sorry for my pronunciation, is home to sand dunes that are formed by wind and ocean currents. The dunes can reach heights, heights I think, of 40 meters. That's really hard. Brazil has the fifth largest 
seal. Whoa, that's a lot. So Paolo has over 11 million residents and Rio de Janeiro over 6 million. And then imagine that the Netherlands in total has about 70 million inhabitants. That's insane. Brazil boasts the seventh largest economy in the world, just behind the UK and just ahead of Russia. Canada is number 11. Brazil has the largest lusophone population in the world. What's a lusophone? A lusophone is a Portuguese speaker. Why a lusophone? It's because the Roman province of Lusitania covered most of Portugal. Brazil was a Portuguese colony for over 300 years and gained its independence in 1822. The Portuguese spoken in Brazil is evidently most similar to that spoken in the 16th century. That's interesting. Indigenous people have inhabited Brazil for thousands of years and there are 180 languages spoken. In 2007, it was reported that were 67 tribes who have never had contact with modern men. Brazil and West Africa were once attached but were broken apart by plate tectonics. Notice how they fit together on a map that is really interesting. Sugar Loaf Mountain in Rio de Janeiro is a volcanic block. A large portion of Brazil is underlain by Precambrian Shield, some of which is older than 2.4 billion years. I don't know what Precambrian Shield means. Brazil produces large quantities of iron ore, but also copper, gold, and diamonds. Brazil is self-sufficient in energy. Petrobras, the state-owned oil and gas company, has made some huge oil discoveries offshore in the Atlantic lying underneath salt layers. The Itaipu Dam located on the border between Brazil and Paraguay is the second largest hydroelectric producer in the world. The dam is 7.7 kilometers long and 196 meters high. Samba music developed in Brazil in the 1800s is still tremendously popular. I don't think I know what samba music is. Brazil effectively shuts down for carnival with partying day and night. It is held from the Friday to Tuesday before Ash 
Brazil. I hope you found this video interesting and relaxing. Please let me know what you think of this video by leaving 